praise, praise the Lord, praise the Lord, hallelujah. Prophet Nyami Ishaw, Nyami Ishaw, Kese, Michiyaw, Ewo, Inewa Di Yesu Christo, Nazarite Nidimu, O Nyami Asem, Enyami Nyo Ba Abeche, Nyami Asem, Enyami Nyo Ba Abeche, I'm going to share the word of God with you, my friends and my loved ones, and my fans also. Hallelujah. Rafu Tini, the Tini, the Sunya Mia, or your Mukala Four. Sanya Mino, the Oka, the Bim, no sense to swear the Vigina. When your menu, a yen of quite a four. It is a professor and an antia, and was seven so yede, a yen of quite a four. Now, tell us, oh, you who never a twinchin, something yame, a young Hallelujah. The Lord or the God you are serving is a faithful God. So, if you want to. Be a Christian, you have to be faithful to, and also you have to live a very good, righteous life because God is holy. You have to be a righteous person because God is holy. Hallelujah. It would have said, Who will change? One to two up in one ma near ma. I knew whom you may not pay whom no money in my pet. Now, only good of way into my day, I attend him by your own. God is a spirit. So, if you want to live with him or if you want to go along with him, you have to live in the spirit. Hallelujah. It is a one to me in your we are not take our home and now home. And near my way in our bed, a package. I was so to me in a minute to nurse it, oh, but that's all you will be alone. Now we have righteous a brabble concon, a head man, and I become a brabble because God is a holy man. If you want to live, live. Righteous life because God is a holy man. Let me say this because it's written in the Bible. If you want to get anything from God, unless you abide the rules of the Lord, unless you abide the rules of the Lord. If you did not abide the rules of the Lord, you can never receive anything from God. Prophet went to me and he would not open a sense. So went to me and he knew me a sense. So went to me and he knew me a person. So went to me and my mother would come to if I yet didn't say, but you may be a free on your point. God is a principle of God. Let us read. Let us read from John chapter 15, verse 7. And you hear what the Bible is saying to us. John chapter 15, verse 7. If you abide in me, and my words abide in you, as whatever you will, as whatever you will, and it shall be done for you. Hallelujah. John chapter 15 verse 7 says, If you abide in me, and my words abide in you, ask whatever you will, and it shall be done for you. You see, 
Bible is saying here clearly that if we abide in Him and His word abide in us, we shall receive whatever we ask in His name. You see, this is what I was saying earlier that the word of God is God. So if you did not go along with the word of God daily or occasionally or any time in your life, you leave God aside and working alone. Anything you are doing, you are doing it in your own. You have to go along with the word of God morning, afternoon, and the evening. And also, you need to add prayers to it. Always, you have to be with God. Let God be your father, your friend, your brother, your sister, your loved ones, your business. Whatever you are doing, you should not leave God alone. Attach God to whatever you were doing. This is what the Bible is saying because it said the word of God is God. So if you do anything and let God without bringing him in to attach what you are doing, then you let God somewhere and you are somehow, somewhere also, then things you are doing, you are doing things in your own. But of what the other person is doing, they say, so we are the people and that's why I'm saying that we can't come. No more, we can't say, 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 we can't the Bible says na unyami ya semana yele e nyami. O se na infiti ya si yelo na asemono e oho. Na asemono ni unyakupon e oho. O se na asemono e yele unyakupon. O se na wanamu ni sonu oye adye ni na. Na wangu koti asemono a ni bibibia la awe yele. Oye. E nu miti no. Se unyakupon kwa wangu koti na asemono. A ni bibibia la awe ya. Na wangu koti nyami ya semono di awe yonu. Anfe nyami ya me mwa. Oje ni amewe chini. Yesa ni wewe yenye ni de enge ni sana sisi ni amina. Watu wapa hasa sisi ni de wewe biila mo. Ebe benefiti wa ifri ni amen. Hallelujah. Ifri ni amen. Kwa sababu benefiti wa nete sisi watu mo ifri ni amen. Na yapo ni sam abe ura wapi. Idu kai trona. Wasi na sisi watu ni mimi mo. Na sisi ma sisi watu ni mo. Bisa bibi biara, lebay ni, lebay yang kau ayat ni, ama tiada apa. Pasti nasi urut saya betul. That is John chapter fifteen verse seven in the kasar seven. Ayat yang aku ingatkan. If you abide in me, and my words abide in you, ask whatever you will, and it shall be done for you. Oh, pasti nasi urut saya betul. Nasi mas saya betul semua. Bisa bibi biara, na wedding, bonsa wedding, ebeka. Um, uni jamu ya bini yangu kufa. Ba bra poshe ni, ubo mpaye, oke kanya utro. Apiri biya ni jamu, ehum hum, etu hum, jamu ehum hum bro etu hum. Iti apiri biya opesi uni jamu kasi biara. Nyami betul, kau suka betul nyami kan? Kau suka nyami ayam mungu. Ini se nyami asem itu mua. Baik kau suka nyami asem ni ye nyami. Enti nyami ni ada betul mungu. Nyami ni nama nama kau suka betul mungu dia awak nak udah, awak nak sorry, awak nak kau cuma, awak nak apa? Tiap hari biar lah, awak ni ni ada, awak ni ni ye. Nyami kau suka. Apa apa yang enjoy? Nyami enti mungu. Nyami asem orang yang kau kain. Empire u mo. Abrabo enye. Ebe ye de ikwe ti mini nyami akasa. Ke ya unu se nyami eye unu. Kwa se kwa ye unu unu. Se unu 
nyame wo gbonkuru nti wo mu a e be ye din se obeti ni yakopon ere kasa e be ye din se oni yakopon be ere be kasa if you are not live with the holy spirit and you do your things anyhow without god in your life you can never speak to god you can never hear god and god can never also hear you too hallelujah avail yourself invite the holy spirit to come and live with you meditate the word of god daily daily morning afternoon and the evening and at the same time you have to pray also give your life fully to Christ be a born again christian and be a righteous man or a righteous woman invite the holy spirit to live in you so that you will always hear what the spirit tells you hallelujah and he said, well, the man is saying, I'm going to now. Now, Abrabono and Sweeney, Abrabono and Nye, and Sweeney, 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 chapter 15, verse 7, it says something, it says, if you abide in me, and my ways abide in you, ask whatever you, ask whatever you will, and it shall be done for you. Oh, so you may not be able to meet. You may not be able to meet. No matter how much you try, because the Bible tells us that we must be able to meet. Hallelujah. Let me take you also to Matthew chapter Matthew chapter ten seven seven. Yeah, let's go to Matthew chapter seven. Also, verse 7. Hallelujah. When you read Matthew chapter 7, verses 7, let us see what is there. What is written there? Matthew chapter 7, verses 7 says, Ask, and it shall be given to you. Matthew 7, 7 says, Ask, and it shall be given to you. When you ask, it shall be given to you. Seek, and you will find. And then knock, and it will be open to you. Hallelujah. Listen to me very carefully. You can't just go to your need and pray and ask, and the thing will come. Unless... Because God knows you and you also know God. Unless God lives in you and you also live in God, you too can communicate because God is a spirit. So if you avail yourself and then God, the Holy Spirit lives in you, you can communicate with God. When you seek, and you did not find. It's called Bible says, seek and you will find. So when you ask, and the things is not permitted or granted to you, ask yourself. Because maybe what you are doing is not good. Maybe what your life is doing is not bearing fruit to God, the Holy Spirit. It will be difficult for you to seek. For when you seek, you will never find. Because God is not living in you. Hallelujah. And he said, Knock, and it will be open to you. When you knock, and the door refused to open. That means 
the person or you are knocking on the wrong time or the person you are knocking his door don't know you because sometimes let me give you this example sometimes you want to go somewhere or you want to go and see somebody you don't even know for the first time and you go to the person's house and you begin to knock the person may not even come and open the door because one the person is not expecting you two the person don't know you and the person is not ready to see you because he don't know you he don't know you so all these things we are talking about is we have to go along with God in our life daily anytime anywhere we have to carry God along because if, if, if we did not carry God along with us then we leave God behind when we started asking God is in somewhere heaven don't even know you when you knock he cannot open because you don't expect anybody that time when you're sick, you know if you're fine because you don't know where God is. So you see, you have to understand all these things. Because these are the rules and the regulations that a man or woman has to understand before asking anything. But if you're a Christian, a good Christian, and you avail yourself, you live with God, you sleep with God, you wake up with God, you carry God along with you any time, any day. And the Spirit of God is living in you. You live in the righteous life. That means God will always be with you. You don't need to shout. You don't need to pray too much. You don't need to, you know, it's easier for you to ask. And you will receive. When you seek, you will find. And when you knock, the door will open for you because the person is in you. You don't need to go far. You don't need to pray too much because the person knows you. You see, when you are a good child and you do everything for your family, your mother, your dad, you obey them. When they send you out, you go. When they call you, you come, do this, do that. Anytime you are about to have something or you are about to ask something from them, when you ask them, they respond to you immediately because they know you are a good child. But if you are a stubborn child, when your parents send you out, you don't go do this, you don't do that, you see, when you ask them, they refuse to give you. They also refuse to give you because you are stubborn. The same thing applies here. If we continue to be a sinner and then we did not do good or we did not stay with the righteous life in our life and we do all sorts of things God can never ever provide our need for us when we ask him because God don't know to God don't know, don't, don't know you. God don't know you. Hallelujah. God don't know you. Because there is no way we can say that you are Christian. You drink, you smoke, you humanize, you have anger, you fight, you steal. Name it. You do all sorts of things. If you are like that, change your ways. Because the Holy Spirit first need to live with you. That the Spirit of God. So that it can connect you to God all the time. Avail yourself for the Spirit or for God to live with you. Hallelujah. Therefore, I will say that the Holy Spirit is not going to be able to do it. Because if you're not a born again, a you may not come. We both and said the open. We just a day away. We are not going to be We are going to be from the Christian. 
We are saying a minimum, but in a minimum, we I don't think our friend are away today, woman. Hallelujah. Let's our friend are away the woman. Because we are minimum. So what you say? It will be silent when some can. We should share in the way. Yamina will share them. We need more. Yamin so a home. And he said, Yamin, my Holy Spirit in the big two more. A better way to my great Yamin. Whom won't you say, no more, yet you are tear who may be out in the natural world? Whom who know any different? And your home, me, you know. And your home, Colonel, my you know, for saying Yamin home, and it would be a better home. And it's a mimi cassa, um, would teach you the betty cassa making us. You want to treat the bed yam. In the yammy a home, the home will be too. It is also so in your make us. The only language God will hear from me is the Holy Spirit that can connect you between you and God. So it's in your mimi will be too more. Would it make us certain be our baby? Better we can also better make us. In your mimi will be too. But then you have to in the idea of some a good tea, your main tea will be sad yet. Now, I am. I woke us out to one dear. A better woman with your poor pay, and a better woman who would bet yes a better chess and brow walker. Amen. Or of war. So we sat out in San Cat, no shadow, no boom, no pony, and ya. Nature say. Nyankupon any day and Tonka. Nature say Nyankupon and no one day and anti. Nature say Nyankupon women in me a rope of a yard. Nature say Nyameno Wedjani day a witch. It gave me Kenny and I said, Mawaneso. Start to say, we go for a brava, a swelling. Start to say, we go for a young coupon, a better now brabo. Would you walk in the Ashina Mensa? Now, young coupon in Shira, a ten year day about. A son say, Yamia, yes, you mean, when you and Yamia are ready, what he has said. But of when Yami in store, Yami no kissing, Yami in the store. And they make any other say, would yammy up pine? My one in so yammy up pine. The tea when you a man coupon. Then you coupon a two million a whole day. A met house. Would yammy up a yellow part of four? One shall move any million a man. Send a man up and tin the new show. Send a man up and shirt with him. Send a man up and be a pine mound. The bones of near my weed in a bed to be. Yahoo and Yabra Buduma, a bed. She said, Name the camera. Hallelujah. Ain't it Bissa? Was it Name the Bemon? Was it Fisher? Now Boom? Was it now Boomer, a Pono Bed in the Bee? Was it no Bibia who was Salam de Mano? The Bibia of the Venu, that the Boom, a Pono Sube Biman, and only a one eye on Ninja Coupon Wire of Buffa, one eye in a man who won't go to. One I am coupon as every number. One no I Hallelujah. Tina Mia Samasa Procope. No, we don't coupon Tina Mitchell. Mawan Sasso, a male one. No, the meaning with my Cassiano, a way she could show that's right again. Yamini Munyam, a Yakasiamaya, would not coupon Tina Mitchell. With a coupon be a palm, my with a me more of mine. One team free near my empty now. No mean whom you two men in a hotel. A son said, Oh, in a mere what he has here. And the Munyam, and I see, and Tontum, and Kaira did he pa a da. My young will say, Yes, you Christo, and the Munyam, a dash of the TSC. Who can verse eighty now? Matthew chapter seven, as I was also for everyone who asks, receive. And he who seek find, and to him who knock, it would be open. Oh, it will be now. So we need to be now. It means that there is something somewhere which is 
not going where in your life. Try to do good in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. May the good Lord 